Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, I'm gonna be ho ho hoing for you guys, okay? I'm gonna give you my top picks for this Christmas season. So, my top gifts for your tennis fans out there. Stay tuned. Christmas. All right, guys. So, we're gonna start on the racket wall here because there's a reason why these racket companies decided to launch rackets and bags um, in the fall so that they can be under your Christmas tree. Okay, so let's start on the wall, guys. Obviously, Pure Drive is going to have to be on that list. So, so if your uh, tennis friend, spouse, or whomever uh, plays with a Pure Drive, you get them this new Pure Drive. That is the best pure drive since the original one. As I keep saying, this is a no brainer. They will love this racket. All right, it's only gonna come in the standard one right now, but hey, most of the people play with the standard one. So we'll stick there, you buy this one, all right? So for the little ones though, for the little ones, the let's say eight and up, the eight and up, we got the 25 inch one out now. So 25 inch pure drive, all right? If Johnny wants a new racket, Johnny should get this one, 25 inches. They also make it in a 26 inch. So for your, let's say 10 year old, that's uh, you know getting into tennis or loves tennis and needs to move into a real racket, this is the one you get. So 25, 26. Now, if your Jane, little Jane, right, wants her own little pink, purple racket, Go here. Look, these guys made a purple racket for little Jane here, All right? New pure drives in kind of purplish pink colors, All right? So we got Johnny and Jane with their pure drives under the tree this year, um, right? 25, 26, you get these. If you really have to have a banana yellow, get a banana yellow, okay? But we're gonna get pure drives this year. Now, moving on over, moving on over. Serena, Serena for somebody that wants a pro stock racket would be a great choice. Uh, we just did a test on it and uh, we all love this racket. Great stick, inch longer, okay? 102 now, 102 square inches. The Clash is still a fan favorite. If you don't have a Clash by now and you want one, get it this Christmas, it's a great gift. All right, you know it comes in 100, 100 Pro, 98, um, light, ultra light, right? 108. There has to be one that fits somebody in your family. Get the Clash. Now, moving on, Racket of the Year, E Zone. If you've never tried a Yonex, or if you're already a Yonex fan, this E Zone's an instant winner. 98 or 100. Get this racket, throw this under the tree. They'll love you for it. Now, for all those Fed fans, all black guys, Fed. If you you're if and who doesn't love Fed out there? If you want to have what Fed supposedly actually uses or feels in the weight and the balance and the you know the whole Fed experience, get them the Fed racket, right? At least they can. Maybe feel like what Fed feels in a tennis racket, right? Who doesn't love Fed, all right? Fed, now, moving on. So the number one gift, uh, pretty much by default every year, at least for us, are bags. Well, I sell a ton of bags every Christmas because, you know, the guys never change out bags and somebody has to buy them a bag in order for them to change out. You know who I'm talking about. I'm talking about you. Okay, so he's gonna buy you a bag and you're finally you're gonna throw out that ratty old garbage bag that you've been hanging out with for 20 years. Okay, so we're gonna get you a bag this year. And this pure drive bag is probably the one that I pick. It comes in a six pack and a 12 pack. And you can see that it's light on one side and darker on the other. It's got this little hard kind of a pouch area that you can put your keys and your wallet. Oh man, I have a problem here. Okay, keys and wallet in here. See, look at that. All right, and your change. 
So I love anything that's on, you know, that's a little sturdier. This is a six pack though. So you put your rackets, where'd this happen? You put your rackets on this, this one side. This is the foil side. They didn't put it foil because they didn't want to, they wanted to save the environment by not dyeing it, uh, you know, like Reynolds wrap color. So, and then you got your other side to put your junk. Look at that. Your shoes go in here. You drop it in on the outside there. Your shoes and your other balls, warm up, uh, towel goes on this side. Let me show you that shoe compartment. Look, that's for your smelly shoes and socks right there. That, that ventilation hole. So it doesn't mold in there. So that's where your shoes go. See, they put it for plastic, just, just for you. All right, and then they got one more compartment on the outside. They keep telling me this is for, uh, to open up your beer. So I'm gonna test that out one of these days. Like more compartments here. Oh, we latch on our keys here. So we don't lose our keys, right? You guys always lose your keys, I know it. Um, you can put whatever else you want here. Perhaps a little purse or a satchel. Uh, you know, whatever else that, you know, the junky stuff you have. You know who you are. All right, so this is the six pack. I'm gonna get the 12 pack myself because I just got a lot of junk, right? Thing gets filled real fast. So get the 12, forget the six. All right, guys. So I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm a big fan of Lululemon. Um, no, I don't buy leggings for myself or yoga pants or capris. They have a men's line, guys, and it's a great men's line. I walked in there two years ago and, uh, you know, I was like, what is this all about? I've been listening to everybody talk about Lulu for, you know, over 10 years and wanted to check, check it out, right? So I walked in there, picked out two pairs of pants, right? I proceeded to, uh, well, wear them to Japan in the winter. Uh, I got them on Halloween, literally, while taking my kid trick-or-treating. And uh, my, my wife got two, too, because, you know, she has to get two, I gotta get two, right? 50-50, you know, you know how it is. Anyways, so I got a pair of these serge pants, right? And I wore them on the plane with me. And man, when it was hot in that plane, it kept me cool. When it was cold outside in Tokyo, it kept me warm. And I was like, what's this all about, right? The main reason why I got these pants was, check it out guys. <clears throat> zipper pockets who does zipper pockets anymore right well lulu does right come on right i'm a i'm a little short guy so it's got a little cinch on the bottom so it actually gives me makes me look a little taller than i am um uh, you know but the zipper pockets was a main thing and check this out check this out right look who doesn't love a little stretch in their life right not going hammer time now but you know gotta feel comfortable right so these aren't cheap but they are wonderful they're super comfortable and for all you men that uh, that have to buy lululemon for your spouse girlfriend or whomever that special girl is in your life just buy them a gift card don't even walk in there because you won't know what to buy lululemon gift card for your spouse, wife, woman in your life, okay? Buy that. Pause. So for your tennis captain or whomever you play with, your tennis buddies or whatever, hey, it's hard to buy them. If you don't wanna buy them a bag, um, hey, there's caps. I saw a ton of these during the holidays, right? Do a little tennis basket for them. And go to Cost Plus or um, whatever's out there that sells baskets. Now Pure One's done, so don't go there. Um, baskets. Put some caps in there, throw a turna in there in a 30 pack or a pro overgrip in a 30 pack, right? And then obviously we need balls, right? They didn't do a 12 pack of balls this year because of the pandemic thing. So, but they still do have these six packs. Uh, that 12 pack would have been perfect because they actually give you a cute little box with it. You can put their name on it. But this year you're going to have to make your own uh, basket. All right. Now, 
I don't, I'm not going to put shoes on this list because in my culture, getting shoes is not good for a gift. Okay. It means I think, I don't know this, but I've been told uh, if you get it in my culture, uh, it means that they'll be working real hard next year, uh, which is not a good thing. Okay. Like working real hard, like more than they want to. So I'm not going to say shoes, but there are a lot of shoes out there. If you want to get your, uh, your special someone in the tennis uh, thing, shoes, uh, feel free. The ultimate gift this year will be this slinger. Okay. You know, I did a video on this already. I will try to link that one uh, to this video and a cool little machine, right? As you can see, it's super portable. You, it fits two cases of balls in there, 144 balls. It'll give you a nice workout in the winter when you got gloves and a beanie on in the snow. But hey, this thing will at least last longer than you because it has a five hour charge life. So if you're planning on getting a slinger this holiday season, order it now, because I think there's a shortage of them already. Uh, so, but this is gonna be the ultimate gift for this holiday season. Now, if all else fails and you're the last minute person and you're just gonna grab anything, well, get them a gift card. Get them some kind of tennis gift card. Go to the online site and do do a gift card, or if your local tennis shop sells gift cards or gift certificates, go there and get one for them. Uh, there's nothing better than the gift of choice so that they can choose what tennis um, items they need, okay? So happy holidays, and I hope that helped you sort out what you're gonna get for your special tennis people in your life. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.